thank you for the purchase of your Innova Diagnostic Tool, which has been designed to work on all 1996 and newer OBD2 compliant vehicles sold in the United States, including all domestic, Asian, and European vehicles. Some 1994 and 1995 vehicles are OBD2 compliant. To find out if one of these vehicles is OBD2 compliant, check the Vehicle Emissions Control Information label located under the hood or by the radiator of most vehicles. If the vehicle is OBD2 compliant, the label will state OBD2 certified. Before you can start using your diagnostic tool, you must select the desired display language, either English, French, or Spanish. First, press the Power Link button to turn the diagnostic tool on. The Select Language screen displays. Next, use the up and down buttons as necessary to highlight the desired display language. And finally, once the desired display language is selected, press the Enter FF button to confirm your selection. After the initial language selection is performed, it, as well as other settings, can be changed as desired in the menu mode. To enter the menu mode, with the diagnostic tool off, press and hold the up button then press and release the power link button. The diagnostic tool lets you make several adjustments and settings in the menu mode to configure the tool to your particular needs, such as the LCD screen brightness, the DTC library, language selection, and unit of measure. To select any of these, just hit the FF Enter button when your choice has been selected. Your diagnostic tool comes with six different buttons that perform a variety of tasks. The power link button turns the tool on and off when it is not connected to the vehicle. When it is connected to a vehicle, it links the diagnostic tool to the vehicle to retrieve diagnostic data from the computer's memory. The erase button erases diagnostic trouble codes or DTCs and frees frame data from your vehicle's computer and resets the monitor status. The DTC scroll button displays the DTC screen and or scrolls the LCD display to view codes when more than one code is present. The enter and freeze frame button, when in menu mode, confirms the selected option or value. When retrieving and viewing codes, this button will display the freeze frame data for the highest priority code. The up and down buttons, when in menu mode, scrolls down through the menu and submenu selection options. When viewing freeze frame data, they scroll through the information displayed. Your diagnostic tool also comes with three color LED lights that give a quick status of your vehicle's health. A green LED indicates that all engine systems are running normally, that all monitors on the vehicle are active and performing their diagnostic testing, and no codes are present. A yellow LED indicates there is a possible problem and that a pending code is present and or some of the vehicle's emission monitors have not run their diagnostic testing. A red LED indicates there is a problem in one or more of the vehicle's systems. The red LED is also used to show that a code or codes are present. Our patented all-in-one screen shows over 20 pieces of vital information at any one time. The icons circled here show the battery power and whether the tool is communicating properly with either the vehicle or PC. Highlighted here are the emission monitors icons found on your vehicle. All Innova tools run a test of them to see if they are complete and functioning properly. These four icons show the status of the malfunction indicator lamp or MIL status, if there are any pending codes, the code history, and the freeze frame data. The numbers highlighted here show you how many diagnostic trouble codes you have and the order in which they were set by importance. The G and M icons signify whether the code set is either a generic or manufacturer specific code. The diagnostic trouble code, or DTC, is highlighted and this will generally start with the letter P depending on where the code was set on the vehicle. Finally, when the diagnostic trouble code definition is given, it is shown in one of three languages you request, English, Spanish or French. Now that we have been through all of the features and functions of the tool, we are ready to start diagnosing your vehicle. First, connect the OBD2 cable with the tool turned off and screw in the pins on both sides to make sure it doesn't disconnect any time during the diagnostic check. Next, make sure the ignition has been turned off. 
locate the vehicle's 16-pin data link connector, or DLC, and plug in the cable. When the cable is properly connected to the vehicle's DLC, the unit automatically turns on and links to the vehicle's onboard computer. Turn the ignition on, but do not start the engine. The diagnostic tool will automatically start a check of the vehicle's computer to determine which type of communication protocol it is using. When the diagnostic tool identifies the computer's communication protocol, a communication link is established. After approximately 10 to 60 seconds, the diagnostic tool will retrieve and display any diagnostic trouble codes, monitor status, and freeze frame data retrieved from the vehicle's computer memory. If no codes are present, the green light will light up, meaning there are no diagnostic codes present. If multiple codes are stored, the red light will come on and you can scroll through each of these codes using the DTC button. The majority of codes you retrieve on your vehicle are considered generic codes, and the definitions will be the same for all vehicles. If you display a manufacturer-specific code, the tool will ask you the make of the vehicle you are working on so the code can be diagnosed correctly. Scroll down with the Down button until your vehicle is highlighted. Then hit the Enter button, and the code corresponding to that manufacturer will show on the screen. To see the freeze frame data, press the FF Enter button at any time, except while you're in the menu mode. To scroll through the information, use the up and down buttons to go from one piece of information to the next. You also have the ability to turn off your check engine light with this tool. To turn off your check engine light, press and release the erase button. A confirmation message shows on the LCD display. If you are sure you want to proceed, press the erase button again to erase DTCs from the vehicle's computer. If you do not want to continue with the erase process, press the power link button to exit the erase mode. If you plan to take the vehicle to a service center for repair, do not erase the codes from the vehicle's computer. If the codes are erased, valuable information that might help the technician troubleshoot the problem will also be erased. And now, all Innova tools come with complete access to the optional CanObd2.com Repair Solutions database. Simply plug your Innova tool into the PC with the provided USB cable, and the Repair Solutions software automatically launches to give you a full diagnostic report, probable causes, repair procedures, most likely fix, and more, which makes Innova the most comprehensive diagnostic solutions company out there today. If there are any questions you still have in regards to using this tool, please consult the full instruction booklet included on this CD. Additionally, if you would like to talk to someone, your questions can be answered by our ASE certified technical staff at 1-800-544-4124 from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Pacific Time, Monday through Saturday.